1954, this location was an old manor house which was later converted into an independent preparatory school for boys aged 4 to 14 and girls aged 2 to 4. This school was unfortunately shut down in 2016 due to lack of educational funding. Several options were explored to see if this school could remain open, but unfortunately none of these options could be guaranteed, hence the school shut down. This location is not a listed building, hence plans have been submitted to demolish this school in February 2020 to build 25 new houses. Unfortunately, this application was refused as locals disputed it. The school was designed by a local town resident who designed up to 100 buildings in the area, hence people did not want to see this building demolished. And now in 2020, all that remains today are empty classrooms, a science block, a gym room and a school that has no plans for the future. Alright guys, so we are back in the preparatory school. Um, I did promise you in my life that I'd come back and properly film this without like, you know, connection errors and stuff. Um, so I'm gonna swing you back around it and things already look like they've changed. So I've had a look down the corridors. Um, already it's a lot more smashed up than I remember. I, I feel like those windows were already all right. I, 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 you know, I can't remember. But right, we're just gonna swing you around it. Um, not live this time, just obviously pre-recorded so that you get good HD. So we're at the first room and it says, welcome to IT. And this is more than likely where all of the, the main monitors would have sat in this case. And then I saw this last time, but you wouldn't have seen properly in my life, but coding club, come along and be a part of the future. Touch typing. Oh my God, do you guys remember that? That was horrible. Touch typing classes. Do you remember those at school? School. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah. No, they were horrible. <laughs> they were awful. A door? Ah, yeah, links into the classroom beside then. So obviously this front of your room and then all of the computers for all of the students would have sat around obviously in like a little, um, a little cove. And that would have been a projector. All right guys, so that was the IT room just in there. And we're making our way up to, I believe this was the science labs. So you've got to remember, obviously I've already done here before, but I'm just trying to remember off the top of my head. So under eights, team sheets, year nine, year 10, year 11. This place is huge, isn't it? It's crazy. Wow. Oh, I just love the science room. Yeah, these are the labs. The periodic table. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah, because these are the glass taps, aren't they? Or are they the water taps? No, they're, wa no, they're actual water taps. Oh yeah. Yeah, no, Jen's right, yeah. That's your gas tap. I just set everything on fire. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wasn't trusted. My teacher, for some reason, didn't trust me with them, and I've never worked out why. Hmm. <laughs> there we are, got some sinks. Yeah, this room is absolutely enormous. It's sad thinking how classes used to actually function in here, and they'd get like proper education, and now look at it. It's just. There's too many kids. How can you teach them? It's just Yeah. You see, I, I kind of enjoyed school. No, you see, I did teaching for about three years um, with my level three childcare, and it wasn't wasn't easy to be honest. But yeah, there's your, obviously your fire exit. Oh, do you remember gas syringes? Ah, oh, coloured paper. Ah, yeah, I remember these. <laughs> yeah, it's freezing. Yeah, we failed to mention what's what's it's like the first week of November, isn't it? I don't know when you guys are gonna see this video, but it's the first week in November and it's literally freezing cold in here. So it's not the best conditions, but then again, I, you guys did wanna see this after my life, so I promise you'll come back and do it. <laughs> no entry. Ace, get out. Jeez. God, play by the rules. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh. First aid. Laboratory, first aid. Oh, that's really cool. So it actually tells you the chemicals that are harmful for your skin. Toxic harmful, acidic. Oh, that's really handy. So I suppose at least the kids then, if, if they're not sure about something, so, you know, go for one of these. Where is it? Copper, copper compounds. And then it's harmful, P-H-S-T. Oh, so they can actually like, they could refer to this when they're doing like experiments and stuff. It's pretty handy. Yeah, all these shells completely smashed out. Look at the mold as well, look at the black mold. Wow. Oh, look at that spider in the corner. <gasps> Oh, it's moving. Can you see that on camera? I'm not getting any closer. Oh, right, yeah. Can you see the size of that? That's not like the size of a chihuahua. No, 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 no. It looks cute. No, cute? Yeah. No. It's only got eight Oh. I'm just going to swing in with Aisha and just check in on these guys. 
Hey, should we just gonna head down the hallway, okay? Alrighty, be safe. <laughs> Bye. Right, so this is like the main corridor. Um, so that was the IT room. Obviously, we've already taken you in there. And it's like glass city down there. So if you, oh gosh. So if you come here, just be careful. I'm not gonna bother with this room because obviously I can just see it from the window, but I don't know what that'd have been. Um, not a computer room because there's not enough computer desks around it. So is there anything on the door? No, it doesn't say on the door. Fuses. Fuses. Yes. Not a clue what this was. Probably an English room. It could be anything. Yeah, yeah. What's we'll that, an English room? And then just on the flip side of the English room, I think this is another, probably the same sort of thing. Look, oh, oh. It's just all left. <laughs> I don't know, what's that on that bit of paper? History? History? Maybe, thing? yeah. Do you know what? Because that looks like some sort of anthology, like the old sort of style. 7th of July 2016. Wow. Nice. And then behind the English rooms. Um, I don't know what this. Let's have a look at that poster. That might tell us something. Fire. No, that's a fire. So room C. Miss Sarah. Hazard. What? What would that be? Monitor by teacher. Classroom doors. It says the room. And it says the teacher, but not actually what it's all about. So. Yeah. Yeah, yet again, I'm not 100% sure what this room is, but obviously still a classroom, obviously, because you can see all the style, but what's that? Curtain. Yeah, there's a curtain. And then, ah, look through there. Yeah, uh, it's yes, into the corridor. Yeah, we just loop around. No, I think it's yeah, the room at the end. Yeah. Uh, room B. And yeah, just another another little empty classroom. Oh wow, look at that old thermostat. Oh my goodness, that is so old. God, that must have this must have been abandoned for some time then to have that sort of thing. You wouldn't see that in a, in a sort of normal modern school, would you? No, definitely not. Is it? Yeah, it's a thermostat. It's a, yeah, heat. Yeah. No, it's very old styled. It's it's got it on wheels, so you can actually you could you can push it into other rooms. That one's wired in obviously behind it because obviously safety for kids, but it will have a socket, an outlet, but you can just put it into another room. Right, so I think that was probably the first top corridor. I'm going to head down near our entry. Oh, hello there. Hiya. <laughs> yeah, we'll head down to the end. Well, hang on, what does this poster say? Mm, no, not about the rooms. No, I'm really curious. It doesn't. Look at all the coat hangers. Look. Oh. Hi. Hi. I'm Barbie. I'm Ken. <laughs> Wanna go for a ride? Oh, look. HPS, that's the skill, values. Teamwork, creativity, integrity, courage, and empathy. One. Not on the floor. No. I, don't know. I like that, that's kind of, that's cute. That's nice. There we are. And look at the fire bell. Wow. What if it just went off? <laughs> I'd freak the hell out. Yeah. That'd be so loud in your ear as well. Right, so that was the top wing where our entry was. Am I gonna go down there? All right, so we're heading down here. This floor is super vulnerable, so if you come here yourself, just be careful. And um, yeah, this bit, I, did, I wasn't a fan of this bit. It starts getting a bit creepy, doesn't it? Because there's so many different places to uh, go up. Yeah. Yeah, there's a downstairs, and that was oh, the main reception. And there was a private staff only access. So yeah, this is when it starts getting a bit confusing. There's loads of little links, but I think I'm gonna follow. There's downstairs, isn't there? Yeah, I know, yeah, there's loads. Yeah. I think I'm gonna head down. Jenny, are you gonna go straight or are you gonna go down the corridor on my left? Um, I'll go straight if you're going down there. It's up to you, I'm just thinking stick together because of um, this place is huge and if we get lost, it's gonna be a bit of an issue. Yeah, sure, I'll just come down. Yeah, all right, cool, I'll meet you down in a bit. All right, guys, so we are down on the second corridor and we've got some cubby holes. All of the ceiling in the glass has completely had it. Even to a point that we've actually got greenery growing through the windows, yeah. Yeah. There we are. Oh, that fireplace. I spotted this. Oh, guys, I found the pigeons again. There's two of them this time. They were my best pals in my live stream. Guys, you might not have seen it, but if you if you have, then you know what I'm on about. If you haven't, then go check it out. And my little pigeon's back. I'm going to go say hello to him. He's probably it's missing me. Has he got a friend? Because yeah, okay. we did hashtag save Barry last time. Barry the pigeon. Um, How did you get to that room? It's gonna fly at me just to warn you viewers, so. Oh, there's three of them. Hi, puppers. Hello. Oh. Hello. 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 Hello.
Hello. At least they can get out via that window. So yeah, so don't worry guys, I wouldn't have left it in here. I've saved a lot of birds from abandoned buildings, but they can actually get out, so don't worry. Look, hello puppies, it's okay. Hello. I think we've got a female at the front and the two back ones are males. Hello, Papa. You can say hello to YouTube. It's okay. Shall I leave you be? Am I scaring you? I'll leave you be. Can I just film the fireplace, yeah? All right. Yeah, we've got a nice little fireplace in the uh, pigeon room. Little cubby holes. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> and then, sorry, 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 I didn't mean to scare you. Sorry, sorry. Why am I apologising to a pigeon? <laughs> sorry, sorry guys. And then I'm going to have to keep my flashlight low for this, but out the front, just outside these windows, is the front of the preparatory school. But I'm going to take you around that way on the end because obviously I don't really care if I get caught once I've done it. And then this, this is probably the most decayed room in the entire building from what I remember. Yes, yeah, so as you can see, just... Yeah, it's completely and utterly had it. Yeah, and even, even the actual, the main panel is bowed where it's just so vulnerable. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah from obviously like wood rot and stuff and where it's rained, it's obviously got the other panels to be really, yeah, just vulnerable, I guess. But right, let's go back down that normal corridor. I'll come back to all this side, guys. Just wanna keep with the team because it's a pretty big location, so. And I'll leave my little squidgins alone. Little squidgins. <laughs> Where'd they go? Guys? Oh, guys? Aish? Okay, yeah. So, flash that off, flash that off. Oh my, oh my god. I don't know if you can see on camera. Oh, that's awesome. But that's, see those tiny little dots on my camera? That is the front of the house, so we're pretty close to civilization. That's right. Cool view, like that, yeah, no, I can't really put my light on it, because I don't, there we are guys, you can, I can just do that. That's the best I can do. And then there's the main stairway, which I will take you down in just a minute. I'm gonna do the top layer first. So, one, 105. Ah, oh, this is probably like an art and craft kind of room, isn't it? All the typical kind of cupboards and the, the, the wash areas for the paintbrush and stuff. Yeah, this is definitely an arts and crafts room. Oh, oh yeah, you got, oh, they're fireworks. This is amazing. Look, viewers. Oh, that's so pretty. You can see the whole of the town as well. It's a shame I can't really pick this up on camera because it looks absolutely stunning. All you can see is little dots. Right, let's keep rolling though because if obviously if we get caught, I don't want to have half the video done. There we are. So yeah, that, that's the art and, art, uh, art and craft door. We're just walking through to the second side of it. Yeah, again, loads of decay. But look at the, look at the just state of it. It's really sad because this building could have been saved at some point. Oh yeah, It wasn't in that bad of condition. And yeah. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. But there's a projector. And look at our recipe. This couldn't have been a cooking room. Yeah, this can't be a food tech room because the carpet. So I don't know. Yeah, no, they couldn't no, but by by law you're not allowed to have a carpeted food preparation. It has to it has to be easily cleaned, so like it has to be like laminate or something. So carpet stores high yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. This is definitely not a food prep room because obviously, uh, for hygiene reasons, it, it hold of the bacteria. Careful, careful. Right, and I said in my live last time as well. So just teaching you guys a little something. This is called wire glass. So if I can get a good angle, two seconds. Oh gosh. I don't know. There we are. So the in in the glass, there's actually wire running through it for the fact that it's designed for the fact that if you hit it, kick it, punch it, it's, it's basically it's supposed to like slice you to pieces. So yeah, for all you new urbex is watching this. Um, or just even if you're not a Rebecca, just be careful of wire glass because it can do some serious damage. What have we got in here? Oh, this bathroom stinks. Oh, I'm not going to stay any long, guys, but there's a bathroom. The absolutely most disgusting thing I've ever smelt in the banner building. <sighs> bad. It's bad. Somebody's used the toilet, I think. We've got the, uh, the boiler, all the mains. Electrical services there. Not really a great deal in there. You've got a really nice shower in there. A shower? Oh, yeah. Oh, well, in a school? 
Yeah. Oh wow, that's but really cool. I was just, I can't hold the phone and do it. But yeah. You can't. Oh, it's really nifty. It's, yeah, but, but it's also it's, really unstable. It's really unstable. You can't get your door. It's open plastic. All the way. How'd you even? But that looks brand new. Yeah. Wow. But it, yeah, it, it's plastic. It's not got any metal in it. No. Um, Why would you have a shower in a school? I don't know. Maybe not after sport, PE? I don't know. It could be that. I don't know. Or maybe. I don't know. What's the reason? Yeah. Strange. Yeah, it's really odd. I've never seen that before. That's a, that's a new one on me. What we got down here? Pretty much an empty room, but massive. Another, yeah. A huge empty room. Yeah, I won't bother with that because there's nothing in there to film. What this? Yeah. yeah. Sponge yeah got the sponge at the top there, hasn't it? Yeah, there's some on the floor. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, soundproof Maybe blocks. Music music yeah, you're right. Yeah. This is more than likely one of those tutorial rooms. Yeah. Where they teach like violin, guitar and stuff. Yeah, yeah you're right, Jen. Yeah, because somebody's ripped them off, obviously, but this whole room would have been completely soundboarded like that. Yeah. And then there we are. There's the school logo, guys. HPS, Higher Preparatory School. I'm surprised that was graffitied on that actually, and these. Yeah. I'm actually quite glad they have them because it's quite, it's quite unique. And then that just links you into that massive purple room that Ace and I have just swung the camera in. And I think that's it for this end. Yeah, that's a fire exit and a storage Ooh. cupboard. Yeah, that must be the fire exit that leads across that. The forecourt. Yeah. 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 Oh, what well, that? Yeah, the bridge. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. It's got to be. Yeah. To the, oh, to the, play, the playground bridge. Yeah, yeah you're yeah, right. Yeah. Yes. Yes, you are right. Yeah. And then the, the bathroom there. was where Alex climbed through, wasn't it? Yeah. So that room just in there. Yeah. yeah. There we are. So that was this corridor. I'm going to probably, what we're we going to do next, go across from the, the top panel or go down the stairs? Uh, I don't know. It's really up to you. Should we head down first? Because we'll make our way back up on the other stairway. Probably going to be the same setup as this. Okay. Cool. So we'll head down I mean, the stairs. Down. See, yet again, I'm really surprised I want to smash up this glass for the yeah. stairway. I am as well. I was There's genuinely one, surprised. One there, and I think the rest of them are all right. Yeah. So Thank God. Yeah. That worries me because I've been told that's about asbestos. Survey marker do not disturb means asbestos apparently. So just don't touch anything enough to kick off any asbestos. God, I bet this was beautiful when Something it was open. Yeah. I've noticed since you've done your live here, yeah. this drinks machine for the water was laying down oh. for somebody. It's definitely been in since we've yeah, done that. Yeah, moved it. Do you know, I didn't notice that last time. No? Nope, didn't even notice it. I don't really see why they picked it up. No, neither. Yeah, disabled bathroom. That all looks, still looks the same, doesn't it? Yeah, it all looks the same, disabled bathroom. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much What's this one? What room is it? 601? Oh, okay, so it's the same as the one above. You know the purple room, the really big one? It's the exact same, but obviously a, a level below. Projector would have been sat there. Yeah, it's, ba it's basically just duplicated, but downstairs instead. First window I found that's not actually smashed. Look, first one. <laughs> yeah, there we are, guys. That's what I thought about the wire glass. So it looks just like checkered, but actually there's wire running all the way through it. So you don't want to mess with wire glass. And we've got another bathroom, I think. Yeah, equally just stinks, but there we are. You get you get the vibe. You don't really need to look at bar. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's literally just duplicated. So we've got the same F2020. Yeah. So it means this people have definitely been up here recently. Oh, cool. It's those cool wall dividers. The panels that slide across to make it into one big classroom. The toilet's still there from my live stream. I remember seeing this. It's so random. Just sat in the corner of the room. Really random. But yeah, that's, so that's the corner of that room. Oh, this. Yeah, it stinks really fishy, doesn't it? I've been to that toilet. It's still that toilet. Yeah. I think somebody's used it and actually, uh, when it was abandoned and not done anything about it. Yeah. Right, so that was the lower floor corridor. We're just going to head down to the, the next strip. Oh, shh, shh, shh. Yeah. Listen, listen. Hey? No? Okay. Hmm, just had loads of banging. I thought it was upstairs. I didn't, didn't sound like fireworks. There's a fire extinguisher. To be fair, there is a chance that we might not be alone in this building because of um, it's quite a popular little place that people have been hitting recently. So just got to be a bit more cautious on this one. Look at the size of rooms. Whoa. I don't remember this. Oh, no, I do. No, I do. No, tell a lie. So that was the, the front main reception. I'll go and do that in a sec. I'm just going to get these side rooms quickly. Got an abandoned toilet and a abandoned sink. 
Nana and Brown in common. <laughs> Do you think they get the theme of this yet? Yeah, it is. Yeah, why, why is this yeah, that staircase links up to the corridor. You know the pigeon corridor, pigeon room? Oh, right, it links yeah. to that one, yeah. And uh, there's the dishwasher or sanitizer. Yes, yeah. Do you know what? If anyone watched my live back, I realised that's been boarded. Yeah. Yeah. You don't normally put that in. Yeah. If it's going to be an outside wall. Yeah. So I've got a feeling that's the other half of the building that we haven't done. So we might have to jump over the other walls and try it that way. But all the food wrappers are still there. The and uh, all of the machinery. Look, there's an oven as well. Really old style oven. And all the sinks. Nice. Guys, you know what we were saying earlier about something feels like it's been boarded up because we can't get to the other side? Yeah. Look behind my head. You wouldn't have that, like Ace was saying, for an outside wall. Oh, Sorry, yeah. shall I let you squeeze by? It's a whole stuff wall. Um, I just think that this looks like toilet sinks, really. Mm. Yeah, but, but why would you have a cooker this big? You can't just, know. that's not easy to move. There, yeah, and you can see someone's attacked that. Look, they've tried to get through that. So I, I think the rest of the, the school is through there. Yeah. It's got to be something, because they wouldn't have done that. Look, it looks almost fresh wood. It's the freshest thing in here. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So it might be a case of going outside and trying to find a way around the front. Yeah. Like they might have dumped the rest of the stuff yeah. from, from that like side. Go through from that side yeah. into this bit because I don't see how that ain't going to go through that. Yeah, thing. no, I agree. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, guys, I'm going to do the bottom layer first because that's the pigeon room that links up to. So I'll go up there in a minute. But feel free to do whatever you fancy. Yeah, yeah, it links up to the pigeon room. All right, and here we are. This is the front reception. I love this rug look. It's literally got the school logo. HPS, yeah, it's brilliant. And uh, we said from the live last time, more than likely that is the actual reception desk because the style of it. Um, and we did notice all the padlocks which have actually moved. Oh, okay, they've moved around. Um, there's a few, but there's new door pieces. So we were wondering if at some point they were gonna actually try and board this place up properly. Because obviously you saw how easy we get in. There's the safe for all the school money. All the school trips and stuff probably all just end up in there. All the, not the school trips, the money, sorry. <laughs> it's late, I'm sorry. Yeah, there's the main reception. This was the front door. So it's like Cobweb City in here. And then all the mains. I would test that door, but I don't want to for the fact that there could be an alarm the other side. Because I have been told security come here often, but I, I'm, I'm yet to have proof of that. Because obviously I've been in now twice. This is my second visit. And uh, got a lovely like living room style. And I really liked that last time. It's absolutely lush. Like who who leaves that, you know? It's beautiful, but and another fireplace. Room 603. Oh, look at that. It's just stunning. It's quite cool to walk into, isn't it? Like, yeah. You've definitely got the reception there, obviously. Yeah. Yeah, it's lovely. Oh, is that you knocking? It's me knocking. Okay. Yeah, it's the bit with the shelving on it, remember? On the side. Oh, oh, I didn't see that last time. What? Maybe they're like locker keys. It's a key bearer or something. Yeah, you'll lock one there. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's for the locker keys, maybe for pupils. So they probably put them in that box when they paid for the locker, they'd give them a key. Something like that. Right. Yeah, again, what would you even think of this as a classroom? Because I, I can't make head I nor tail of this. I can't be in a classroom, as I was just saying, I don't know what they would have used this one for. No. Do you reckon a waiting room, maybe? It could yeah, be or a staff briefing room, maybe, or something along those lines. Silly, could this not be maybe the caretaker's part of the home? Maybe. Like, and they live on site and take care of the school? There's a possibility, to be just, fair. These just seem to me like bookshelves. Yeah, yeah. These yeah. Just like bookshelves. And look, but look at the lighting, that's the bit that throws me. Look at all the lighting, it's all like proper professional spotlighting. So you, you have got to wonder really, um, that, that's a beautiful piece. <clears throat> out of what? Out of bounds, make space. Pay designer, really. don't know. So we went down there and I think now it's up to this, up this stairway. Yeah, so this room in front is just to the kitchen and then obviously meaning the pigeon room, so it's all linking. And I think it might just be that last top wing. Well, for the moment anyway. Right, let's head through here. All right, so we've got those, this is back up to the pigeon room area. So 
that was the pigeon room. And what we got in here? Right, come this way, just in case I don't want you getting lost or anything. Is this the pigeon room as well? Here it is. Sorry, guys. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, pigeons. So we've got another beautiful, big, big room and a lovely fireplace with... Look at the detail as well. It's like detailed tiles, like little boats and stuff. And if I turn my light off... Hey, she can keep yours on. Just stay there, stay back there. No, 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 go back there. Yeah, just so we don't get a bounce back from the glass. And then look, that's out the front. Oh, it's so pretty. You can't really see that well on camera, which is kind of annoying, but you can see the entire town, all the little houses, even people in their little windows. <laughs> and then got another big room with the same sort of fireplace design. It's still got all those beautiful tiling on it. Cubby holes. Yeah, this, this place is just full of them. You don't really get a fireplace in schools anymore because of obviously health and safety. What's in there? Oh, that's that. Oh, it's them. Oh, Aisha. Bless him, you probably can't hear me. Um, what's in this one? Do you want to... <laughs> What's that way? How take that door? Wait a bit. Right, there was the loft for the hatch we saw last time. The ladders are still there, but they are metal, so they're obviously not going to go anywhere. Got a, what's this called again? Hot water thingy. What's it called? Boiler. Boiler. <laughs> That's, I, I know what I was trying to say. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day. Um, another empty big classroom. I'm not going to bother with it because there's nothing to talk about. Ugh. And this one is, oh my God, that's literally not budging. Oh, it is. Another big empty classroom. Fireplace, not a great deal in there. Um, I might close that. No, it's going to stay. And then last time I saw these, so it's got all their names. So James 6M, Jack 6M, Archie 6M, Connor 6M, William 6M, Jake. Yeah, you, you get what I mean. But maybe that was their classroom, their tutor. Yeah, the tutor maybe. might have been called 6M. Um, so we've done all that. We've actually done everything down there. So I think this is the last, the last avenue, really. So do you want to take that door? Oh, we've got to go to another story. Didn't realise that. Oh. A little yellow room, which smells oddly like drugs, doesn't it? Has a funny little tinge to it. Oh, where was that linking to? I don't think we found that last time. I can hear them. Yeah, they're just below us, I No, wait, they're in here. What? Oh, oh, you no, made me jump. Been... Oh, hey, jump. we just had oh, a circle. No, that's why, that's why we've gone wrong. Sorry, ignore us. So what? What's down the little there? bathroom. Yeah, there's not really much, but, there, but we have noticed there is another staircase, which I don't remember hitting last time. Do you remember this? Because I don't. Should I have a little gander up there? There's just obviously go careful on these stairs. So I don't remember coming up here. It might just link us back to the top floor. I'm not too sure. Oh, no, I don't remember this. No, I don't remember. Ah, oh, there's the loft. There's another ladder. Yeah. No, I do not remember this. That room looks kind of creepy. Can you go first? That ladder that you just um, that metal one. That's where I must have been, that hatch. This hatch? Yeah. yeah. That's the one that Alex saw. Do you remember when we did the live? Yeah. And Alex looked up the hatch and he said there's another whole layer and we forgot to do it. So this might be the other side guys that we missed that we were talking about earlier. I think it is. Hey, should I shut up there, mate? We're just gonna have a look down there. Just feels a bit spooky, doesn't it? Oh, look. Prep tracksuit. Oh, hang on. Tracksuit? Yeah. So uniform, eh? Yeah. Like cricket shirts and stuff. So maybe they'd sell them up here. Ooh, looks like Jack Wills. Yeah. Yes, the colours. My favourite shop in the world. Yeah. Literally, I live in that place, don't I? There's a padlock on the floor as well. It's been busted off. Oh, there's a really freaky little cove in there. What does it say? Wad of cash hidden somewhere. Two grand. <laughs> yeah, I wish. Okay. What you really think someone put two grand in here and just walked away and was like, oh, well, I'll just leave that there as a little hidden gem. Yeah. Leave a little nice little note. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. You're going to go look for that two grand gem. 
What's down there? Is there anything down there? No, just a cool space. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's the outskirt. Yeah. But this is the most stuff we've seen in here so far. Lots and lots of wires and uh, electrics and bits. Like and sub. Hey! You know what to do, guys. Find anything up there? Nothing really to it, to be honest with you. Okay. It's just a loft then? Just a loft. Just stops there, stops there. There's a water tank. Oh, there. okay. Yeah, we Nothing great then. It, no, we missed this, yeah. This just runs the whole outside of the building, so lockers. Question mark. Do you want to open that cupboard? No. <laughs> literally nothing. So I'm not going to bother up there, guys, because like Aisha, there's literally nothing up there. I'm a bit more curious and dubious to do these now, because if I... Whoa. Shh. Oh, it's the, the traffic on the road. I was going to say, oh, that sounded scary. What is all that? Somebody's kicked the door in. Look, they've actually kicked it because the way... The frame snapped out. Look, it's actually snapped. Wow, they were really desperate to get in here. We literally just crawled for a hole and we were sorted. Another kind of like surface area. Front windows, hang on, put your light down. No, no, I mean when you put, put it, put it, no. Go out the room, go out the room, it's bouncing off really badly. I think we're at the highest peak. Yeah, it's only because your light will bounce off the glass and actually sound well as well. We're being quite noisy, aren't we? Yeah, I've got a bathroom in there. This is the final room. Oh, look. Posters. Health and safety. The law. Employee liability. This, I think, is a staff room. Because it's got one of those very hot water kind of tap things. God, they've gone to town on this, haven't they? Uh, what? Well, oh, they've bricked up half of it. That's that's really odd. That is really odd. You'd, why would you do that? Design-wise, that doesn't really make any sense, does it? And what is out this window? Doesn't seem to be a great. Oh, there, we go. guys. Yeah, look. That is to the front of the reception. Do you remember us standing in there? And then that was the front of it. No flipping way. That's so cool. So we've yeah, we are at the highest peak. This is the bit we missed. Oh, I'm so happy we came back now. If you poke your camera out of that window, you can see the front main reception, the glass doors. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can actually see it all. Oh, Starbucks, coffee, coffee. There we are. And I think other than that, guys, that might be uh, this explore complete. Right, a long story short, guys, we've just heard very, very loud rustling, I believe, outside the building, like really loud. Um, very heavy footed, like somebody's walking through it. So, um, not only have we completed the building, which is great, but also it's now an excuse to actually get the hell out of it because I don't feel very safe hearing after that. So we're probably gonna be approached. I'm gonna keep the GoPro running just in case. And if you don't see anything, it's because nobody turned up. So let's get out of here. Right guys, so we've just finished the explore and I completely oh, forgot there is a- <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Um, we forgot to film this room, so very, very quickly before we leave, there is a kitchenette, a dishwasher, and just like a massive kind of kitcheny room. But this is not a food tech room because there's carpet, so we know that for a fact. But right, we are actually leaving now. Let's 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 head out because of that rustling and stuff. And somebody earlier. Where's the exit? There. That one. Away. Right. Let's go. Oh fuck! Jesus I just course. hit my head so hard. Yeah, no, no, on the shelf. <laughs> that really, really hurt. I think I've just knocked my brain oh, out. He just hurt himself. No, nearly. He just, I just heard something. Oh, oh, I think I've hit myself. My head injury. Ow! Katie Colston's concussed. Did you hear that? I hope they heard that on here. <laughs> Smash my brain out. That is not even a, a, a thin shelf either. That's. I was trying to get a cool shot and then I hit my head. Mm. Poor Katie. <laughs> right, this time let's do it sensibly. <laughs> right, let's roll. <laughs> I'm so <confused. laughs> Hello. Hello. Shalom, viewers. Shalom. Oh, oh. Oh. oh my God, I'm tripping now. Jesus. God, we're falling over, we're tripping. Hitting our brains out. It's not been a good night, is it? <laughs> it's getting quite, quite dangerous. Where's Jenny? She's hiding. Ah! <laughs> there she is. Why do you make everything look so easy? It's actually quite annoying. <laughs> Makes a change for me. No, so you've just done, you've done it easy. Now, now watch him. Look how difficult he's going to make this look. Ow! <laughs> 
Ow! <laughs> we both hit our, I hit my head, you hit your legs. Yes! Yeah. 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 Right, well, can on make Asia. as much noise as possible now? Well, no, let me get my pa some panning shots out yeah, the front first. Let's go out the front. All right, go on then. Naughty. Just, just see how bad it is, or not bad it is. Do you know, it's only when I do videos like this I actually realise how bad our English is. Like, Did I can't see. Did you a woman looking at you through the window opposite? No, what woman? Just no, I didn't. Woman. If I'd have seen that, I'd have said something, wouldn't I? I'd have gone, oh yeah, just like, no, somebody's looking at us. Brilliant. Well, she shook her tic tacs at me, so I ran. Tic tacs. <laughs> I don't know how to get this down to the front. <laughs> shook her tic tacs at you. Yeah, what are you on? The... Oh my god. You're mad. You know that. Oh yeah, just for you viewers, we can't actually get into these ones, so yeah, they blocked. are completely boarded. Probably not, man. Probably not. Nope, no chance, but we're going to try and get around the front and have a little look at the view. Right, there's the front of the building, guys. Just walking along the side path now to try and get a good shot of it. Oh, there's a palm tree! Mm, Church, they're actually really expensive. Mm. Right, that would have been the main reception, wouldn't it? Yeah. And that was the window with the pigeons. Yeah. What was that? Yeah. 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 <laughs> There's all the windows we've been hanging out of. You've been hanging out of windows again? Yeah, can't help myself. What? Oh, that is amazing! <laughs> what? Ow! <laughs> I can't read a word of it, says, but yeah, something or other. Founded 10th of June 1997, Peter Attenborough, governor of preparatory school something headmaster of charter house character house something like that yeah there we are something like that yeah there we are so 1997 this was founded there we are we're actually getting some history it's quite handy um do you have a look at the basketball court or not i'm not really faced with it you can just see it from there can't you, yeah, you can just a court there. yeah there. there's the court guys this is what i want oh oh hang on no 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 no, look, that, what's that thing on the top of the pole? Yeah. That yellow flashing. Yeah. Round the side to the left of that is where I saw the camera on the wall on the oh. left hand side up there. But that is something. Because obviously that's the main entrance. Yeah. So they've probably put that there as a deterrent. To stop people. people. Yeah, but. that's the front door that we were talking about earlier. This is the front of it. Whoa. Okay, that is that looks much bigger from the outside, doesn't it, than it does in the end. Well, I'm glad we've done it. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Absolutely stunning photo. Or videography, whatever you want to call it. And then there's the other side. Oh. Right off. It's cars. What's the best? That's the security. Well, I hope they don't turn up because I've only got like 2% charge, so I kind of want to catch it if they catch us. Should we sneak around that bit and have a look in that hallway and see if we can get in there? Should we just try it? That on the signpost is just a little sticker to scare you. Yeah. Little high vis, which actually did work, didn't it? For a split second, I was a bit... Oh, how do we get out of here? Oh yeah, just squeeze through there. There we are, jobs are good. Oh, you're right. Oh, is it not as easy as I said? Oh yeah, it's a bit of a, a, bit of a weird angle. Oh. Oh yeah. Yeah, this building, I really wanted to get into this, but it's all boarded up. I think that must have been a gymnasium. Yeah. Even if I could stand on that roof, I just want to look through it, but is that house functional? I can't work it out. It looks abandoned. So that's the car park, this bit. Obviously there's the main building. Oh, my lights just died. Oh no. Yeah, so there's the main building, which is really hard in this lighting now because I've gone down to one torch. And there's obviously the rest of it. But I think, guys, this is pretty much this explore complete. 